I really like creative media production as a major in itself because of the building and everything it offers. We've got studios, computer labs, cameras, I mean, you name it, uh, the OU's got it here. Uh, the reason I chose creative media production, there are a number of reasons. The first is that I absolutely love movies. I mean, you got Anchorman, uh, Goodwill Hunting. I mean, I love the way the music affects people in the theater. I love the way visuals affect people in the theater. And I love to interact with people, so I figured, hey, why not try and uh, bring that emotion out by not being physically there with them? I think it's a, an amazing thing whenever you can put together a piece of film and music and bring out someone's emotions that they probably didn't know that they had in that moment. It's beneath the shadow of darkness where we discover the truth that makes up the words we speak. Like little glimmering specks of dust, dust that float off our tongue, tongue it's, it's the, the light, light that we see. Experience-based learning classes with an instructor you know cares about you provides a safe environment to be creative and get to know your instructors and for your instructors to get to know you. It was an actual learning experience and that's what I, yeah, I enjoyed it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really like to think of myself as a mentor to my students because I've only been teaching a few years. Um, I felt it was very important to become an instructor at my age after 40 years in the field, in the production world, because when you experience these concepts and skills hands-on, you use them in the productions that we're having you do in our classes. So as a mentor to my students who are going out into that world, I'm trying to give them the skills I know they need in that world to get hired. So my professional experience includes working as a cinematographer, a commercial director, a screenwriter, and a feature director. So when I came to OU, my focus became creating narrative fictional projects. I teach screenwriting, I teach three classes. There's the visual writing class where students learn to tell short narrative stories. And whatever, whatever we're calling this radio thing blows up. All of a sudden he gets an email, checks his phone, it's from his advisor, Amy. And it reads, hey, bro, you're short one credit hour. You need, you need to figure this out. I'm, you know, come meet with me. We'll figure it out. When a creative media production student graduates, the most important thing that you need to have is a reel. Something that you've done significant work on that shows your taste, your ability to tell a story, and your knowledge of production and post-production. Um, basically, your interests are going to drive what you walk out of this program with. But whatever that is, your reel needs to reflect that. I started at OU in LA last year. It's an eight-week internship program in the city of Los Angeles where students will serve internships as well as take a television writing course. The students will also get a chance to meet alumni who have moved out to Los Angeles recently from this program and are very interested in helping you find work yourself. Because the truth is there's a lot of work in Los Angeles. There's a lot of entry-level work. You just need to be a really good hustler and get in there and get it done.